guys. Hello everyone. Nobody is here. Imagine nobody comes. Six current viewers. Hello. Oh, hello. Hi hi. Nice to see you. Again and again. We are starting the tour. We're showing you the whole building. Yeah. Amazing. Live from the Zebra. So you get an inside. We have the biggest floor. We have a good good view over Eindhoven. Yeah. And uh, from here on, we're gonna go to the whole building. So we kind of, yeah, we wait three minutes and then we start. Is that okay for you? And whenever you want, you can feel free to, feel free to put something in the, in the chat. In the chat, we love that. I'm gonna be on the phone and see what's going on in the chat. Mm -hmm. So I'm live. So two people <laughs> Hello everyone. Hello everyone who's joining. We will show you the whole university, the whole building. We are currently at the C bar where we all get our food and Hello. drinks. Here you see Katrine, <laughs> the pink lady. Yeah. That was, um... We are on stream. Oh, we are on stream. Yeah, you are. I'm on live. <laughs> no, you don't have to. <laughs> so, so yeah. what to say about the zebra? This is the place where you can come eat uh, all around the day. Um, you have a lot of different choice, always, uh, I don't know, sandwich soup, salad, all the snacks. Some good soups. Good soups. And always cheap and always, they cook most of the time after Ottolenghi. So they love Ottolenghi and we love it too. Mm -hmm. uh, so they make like uh, interesting recipe with like a Yeah, of, uh, so they never make boring food, they always do something uh, something fresh, healthy and good one. So they yeah, really are yeah. uh, enjoying their work and they uh, really want to offer us good food and healthy food. Here so, you yeah. can see some students who work for the Zebra uh, because the Design Academy offer like, also jobs yeah, and uh, the Zebra is part of it. So you yeah. can also work at the Zebra. And uh, they adapt to your schedules and, uh, yeah. and uh, yeah, all of that. And normally, this is the place to visit uh, in your break yeah. and everybody's here, but now it is because, because of, COVID. of the COVID restrictions. Uh, you, you just can pick up and uh, then you go again. But normally, this is the living area. Yeah, normally where everybody everyone can is sit visiting. here, you can meet and mix during the, with the old yeah. here. The, the you can teacher. meet the masters, meet the uh, bachelors from the higher degrees and you really get to know each other. Uh -huh. But uh, anyways, you get to know each other really quick in this university. Yeah. So we go one floor down. This is the second, uh, how do you call it? Uh, eating area. room. Yeah, eating room. Restroom, whatever lunch, you need. Lunch space. So um, when you have something left over from the day before, you have a microwave. We're gonna show you, and uh, yeah, and this is the can, place. And you can sit here and have lunch here, or just walk here. Yeah, rest, uh, sleep, whatever you need. <laughs> yeah, it's a hand place. Yeah. So now we go to the stairs. We have an elevator, but we are healthy and do the stairs. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so um, we're gonna have you give you an insight about masters. Normally, it's not part of bachelor, but it's part of the university. So we show you just a little detail that there are masters, and you have exchange with the masters, and you see what the professional big boys and girls doing. Yeah. So. Um, 
You always see what's going on. If you want, you can always visit yeah. these yeah, places. The streets are super free. You Nothing feel is locked. Free to just like go have a look. And you see, this is the house called. Uh, we call it the dirty room. The dirty room. This is the, as you see, some people walk there just here. Yeah. Um, it is the place where you can just experiment and like be dirty with the material and like do crazy projects. Um, and uh, be totally free about space, so yeah. it's nice. And Sweet. here, uh, all the f master's floor. Yeah, where we go in now is uh, maybe we have to be a little bit quieter because, yeah, because there are lessons. But we don't have really anything to say, so just have a look. So we don't know a lot about the masters, but we have a chat with them sometimes. Yeah. And uh, sometimes also, yeah. Most of the time, masters help bachelors to uh, to develop also and help them in their projects. So this is quite cool to have someone who or people who are already um, one step ahead. Mm -hmm. And uh, as you will see in this school, they really work in this open space space to like keep the like no doors between department people, and you can every time have a look question sharing with the other uh, classmates or yeah. everything. So yeah, this is just a quick view. Um, but yeah, it's... Yeah, this uh, is really big, you can just have a look. And huh? You can just have a look. Yeah, out of time. So yeah, this is a... Uh, this is the professional space. <laughs> and... Uh, yeah. But what I remind we are, you of the geo design, contextual, contextual design, design, critical yes. design department in masters. Yeah. But honestly, we don't know a lot about. It. But, <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, but it's uh, good to see what. Mm. Uh, but anyways, you will meet master when you are school. Here. Yeah. And uh, yeah, also to talk about what they are, their experience, whether they come from. Uh, uh, what which jobs are available on this planet and uh, really a lot of things you didn't know about so it's good that they they are here in the same building and um, we can ask them how the how the things work outside exactly so we're gonna go to the part that matters <laughs> to the fourth floor which yeah. is the floor of the studios. Of the second and third. So after the first year, which is all around basics. And really guide your, you fall <laughs> in this really, oh yeah, sorry. <laughs> uh, uh, in this really open system. Yeah some studio and you have like before your internship you have free semester where you can every, every time ch change your studio studio are about like are about thematics and not about special departments and uh, for example you have a ULC but you have like a thinking hand morning studio urgency it's also on the website if you identity. want to inform yourself on the studios but yeah, you have to choose after the first year a way you want to go. So the first semester you are in, uh, you ha you choose one of these uh, studios. So this, for example, is the is the Thinking Hands. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> so it's really about making, experimenting material, every material, and uh, yeah. Develop but yourself in contrast, and you have like some other studio, like the studio turnaround, where you are like really about uh, research. Don't really don't know, but yeah, it's no, it's just it's questioning. Really research, but, yeah, questioning. It's questioning things. Projects real, like real long research uh, about research and, also uh, problems solving uh, I heard, like, issues. The, the Muncher studio is a studio where you have like a lot of technology around. So, but honestly, yeah. for now, we don't know a lot. But um, for now, it also that doesn't doesn't depends yeah, for, for us for the first year. But in second we year, did, we didn't say that we are from first year bachelor. Yeah, so we are not here yet. But uh, you can imagine like that. It's like you go 
you have three days studio so you create a way you want to go you create or you go in a uh, more industrial way or in graphical way or in a research way and then you have the second choice which is uh, two materials so you choose for example basic. metal and uh, wood classic or um, you choose uh, plastics, plastic textile, ceramics yeah so we show you the uh, the workshops later um, yeah. And then you can uh, uh, have an uh, elective, yeah. uh, which is More typography or synthesizers, or there's so many things, like so many ways you can go. So this is about, uh, from the second year on, you really have so many ways to go through this university. Yeah. So no way and, uh, is written. Now, as the first year, we don't know a lot, but until this week, we start a new coaching class with a tutor which is about future, so after school, but also for next year, what we want to do, what we like, where we want to be guided. And so we will discover all the studio really soon, which uh, uh, for now, yeah. I think on the website, it's more, we, you, we know more about the thematics of about the studio, but it's still, like it stay really open still. Yeah, maybe we just go on for studio techno geographies. Yeah. You see some projects that you can imagine uh, what's going on here. Yeah. Some chair prototype. Yeah, you have some chair prototypes, for example. Um, so yeah, uh, I think there's no restriction at all. There's no way you can't go here from the second year on. Um, so it's really individual, really uh, what you're interested in and every half a year you can change it. So you're just into graphic design and afterwards you know someone else making super interesting uh, industry design stuff and you, after half a year you can just switch. So and no thing is re repeating, so you can can also stay three semester oh. in just one studio if you just love it. Yeah. Uh, so. And also, people choose the, um, their studio depend of the tutors, like if you like the their works or stuff like that, the teacher. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. Here, the thinking hand. Crazy. Yeah. This is the most. Hands making studio, so you really see a lot from what's going on here. <laughs> um, yeah, but Thank of course. <laughs> so yeah, now ah uh, yeah. Uh, glass room. You have this type of glass room at every stairs, and like some workshop here happening. Hey, do you want to be interviewed, guys? No. <laughs> About school, do oh, the open about day. second year. We don't know how it's worked really. Third year, she is very Third second year. year, oh, third year, both. I mean, it depends on how long, like if it's more than five. No, no just ten short ten introduction. Ten. What is the yes, second year about, how it works? What is the question? Um, how second year works? Because as a first year, we really don't know. So you have the studio, the basic and the... Elective. Elective. Yeah. What did you choose for example? Uh, for me, in my first semester, I chose identity. And then with, a, like, with the elective of queer in practice, which was all about like queer literature, and we got taught in that. And then I had basics in wood and ceramics, I believe. But now they did change it because that was like two years ago. Mm -hmm. And what they do now is that, for instance, for your basic, you get to choose um, between four, I believe. You get to choose plastic, ceramic, wood, or textile. So there's much more choice, and I think that's better. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. And yeah. about identity, can you give an example of What do you do in your studio? You um, why did you choose it? Why I mean, I chose it because I'm very much into fashion. Like, I really like doing that. It's also one of my passions, but I don't know. I was, I mean, every semester identity changes. Mm -hmm. So in my semester, it was all about yourself and kind of showing your inner identity and like all the different aspects of that. So, I mean, it was very interesting. It was mainly obviously fashion related, uh -huh. but I think now there's more opportunity to indeed like go more into furniture or go more into like, 
like very small details. Like I think there's more, yeah, chillness in that in a sense. Cool. Thanks for the insight. Do you want to or no? No, it's fine. Have a good Bye. evening. I'm sorry. <laughs> Maybe we can check the question with you. Huh? Yeah, I can check the questions in the chat if you want. Oh, do you want to? Oh my god, what happened? Okay, in which studio are you? In which studio? I'm not on the fourth floor, I'm uh, in the Mu Space Do Make. Oh, Mu Space, so it's out. It's, uh, it's at the first floor. You go through the workshop all the way to the back. Oh. You should have a look. There's okay, can, can you meet you in a, in a minute? There, I'm now at the fourth floor. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, it's okay. okay, okay great. What so are you making? Make, what is it about? About uh, making. Uh, yeah, a lot of uh, making, a lot of like, you have a lot of free time, like, you just make what you want, do, uh -huh. do what your passion is. Oh, great. That's okay. really, like, they're not gonna force you into a certain but not subject. every studio is like that no some yeah. are very structured so it was your way to decide that you need that freedom yeah yeah and maybe now i need a bit of structure because it feels a bit like i'm you get put in this like as if i'm already working on my own and making my own stuff so i have to decide okay yeah. i'm gonna make this that and that and yeah okay if, nice. if it comes out of your pure passion, they see it, mm -hmm. and then they say, okay, you're working good. The teachers will say, okay, go on like this, yeah. you know? Okay. If you're not working from yourself, then, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. okay. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks Thank a lot. <laughs> Have fun. You're, making, uh, you're interviewing all the... No, 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 no. no. second person who proposed to be interviewed. Thank you. So no questions Bye. since here. Just feel free to uh, ask, but we also only have eight people sh looking. <laughs> so here we go again. Let me just get back there. Thanks. Only so eight people. everyone missed the good part. We yeah, <laughs> of course. Uh, this is uh, the 3D printer uh, workshop. So you have. A lot of 3D lab. printers actually and different sizes and uh, yeah you can print here whenever whenever needed and uh, you can also have a laser cutter here so you can laser cut acrylic uh, wood uh, what what you want or what is possible mm -hmm. Did you ever feel fell left alone with your learning progress in any of the studios or do you feel like you get a lot of support on your journey? Um, that we are not part of a studio right now, but uh, it depends on the studio because some studios shouldn't support you that much because it's on your own and some others are really supporting and uh, really structured so it really depends which way you go but there's always support especially personal and individual when you have problems yeah. for developing you have you always, always have a coach on wednesday you always have someone uh, looking after you so it's mm -hmm. really individual still we, we don't really know for second year but in first year we are it's, really following yeah like and we have really friends and suitors they are really close they're really taking care of us yeah. Hello. <laughs> uh, open day. Do you want to be interviewed as a master? Yes, yeah, go. Oh yeah. Oh my God. Let's go in yeah, here. This is the last thing we have. Ah, no, no, thanks, thank you. Ah, uh, yeah, you're the camera. Come on. Real life, yeah. Okay. Uh, I leave all the stuff. So I was in the room too. In the third room. Perfect. So here, a little interview of Eric. Uh, a student in contextual design. Contextual design. So, how is it? <laughs> about contextual, or about the master, about uh, what? Yeah, about the master, about the mindset uh, with the master. Yeah. yeah, I mean it's uh, it's 
kind of a um, um, big group, like we are like a hundred. Uh, <laughs> ah, okay, okay. Yeah, it's uh, it's it's uh, it's really cool. A lot of diversity, like. Uh, uh, all the people are from all over the world, so it, this is a, it's like amazing to be in this uh, mix of uh, cultures and um, and just different mindsets. It's uh, it's it's really interesting to see how uh, different people uh, see the world and design and art in general, and it's really um, uh, passionating to to be in this mix of cultures. And uh, yeah, and. Uh, the, the, the academy is uh, really really cool, like the workshops and everything. You, you can have access to some. Yeah, yeah, to the workshops. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, I've never been to, to the textile one, but like for example, I love metal and metal workshop here is insane. So just for that, it's uh, definitely worth it. And yeah, I mean the the, the atmosphere is, is really cool, like very very cool. Okay, bye. So here, the um, textile workshop. Textile workshop. So in Hi. Hi. So the first year you get an insight, but especially from second year on, you really dive in if you choose the studio that matters <laughs> for textiles. But also in first can, year, uh, depending on your trimester, you have a little introduction to this this workshop. And after the idea is to get more and more comfortable with it and to feel free to come wherever you want. <laughs> All the interview. Uh. Do a lot of people continue with their masters at the academy after the bachelor? Uh, uh, I, think, I so. think the most bachelors are not from the design academy. No. So I think, uh, especially normally uh, in uh, design, you wait uh, after your bachelor a few years because you want to be part of uh, the industry or create your own artist development uh, process. So uh, you not you not directly dive and into. about what you do after the school, this is what happened here, um, the coaching. Uh, we start coaching until today. Yeah, coaching, So we don't yeah. know a lot about it. Sorry. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. We have to leave here because the coaching the is... performance class area for the Society in Change trimester. Um, this is all about performance through photography to film. Uh, to body, to body be, uh, be aware of your body, of your movements. Mm -hmm. And this is the first classroom we're going to visit. So this it's is a uh, society and change trimester. So in the first year, you are separating three semester and so three classes. Here's the society and change one. Uh, with Lauren, uh, we begin with that. Yeah. So we was... Uh, with, it was uh, so performance class, philosophy in practice about drawing and shape. Yeah, um, finding shapes, industrial design, subjects, industrial design with metal. metal workshop. Uh, we make a drawing machine with some yeah. Arduino and a bit of yeah, a so. little bit of programming, uh, mm -hmm. and it was really yeah, it was yeah. really about doing it. it was uh, you always a little bit uh, thrown in the cold water, but you definitely get help uh, and you definitely mm -hmm. get. Uh, enough motivation. Uh, uh, in this class, you have a bit of um, metal workshop. Some machine here to like... Just to start. try out, there are some machines uh, mm -hmm. because you don't want to go all the way down to the wood uh, to the metal workshop. So you have quite a few here the upstairs. And there's also this uh, elevator radio, for example, that is developed by students. So you always can change and uh, create something yeah. new. This is a uh, good example, like a project from students. They create this radio and now a lot of people are allowed to like do whatever they want with it, make show. Or and they also workshop, teach workshops teach how, how to mix, how to DJ, how to, uh, how to create a radio, how yeah, to, how to scenario build up. And stuff. This yeah. is really nice. And this is, I think, from the master student. And so they get the room and like... Uh, yeah. yeah. 
Here's some project from Buddy and Mind. The uh, ceramics with paper combined into a, at the end there's a teapot, but there's so many different ways to do it. So the end result is uh, always not comparable, and it shouldn't be. This first year and the whole whole university is not about comparison. Yeah, it's way more about individual sharing, sh <laughs> sharing yeah, and exchange. Yeah. Here you have some room you can book to have a quiet space, to can have meeting with people. Uh, she, she took your stuff out. So yeah, here's a, it's, it's Wednesday. Wednesday is non-study day. So you have Monday and Tuesday uh -huh. and Thursday and Friday in first year. So no teachers are here, but everybody's doing their own projects or doing homework or doing uh, whatever they want or just visiting and chat. So, uh, yeah, here is the ceramic uh, stuff going on and uh, also video project is in, uh, in this trimester yeah. and all the, all the classrooms are not closed so you just dive into all the other trimester even if you're not, if you're not actually actively there. So yeah, as you see it's always a big room, a big open space with like fake wall to keep the door open. Uh, does it sometimes happen that you don't get a spot in any of your preferred classes? In the first year you don't have to choose anything, but in the second year it can happen. You have to choose between two studios and when you don't get it for the first semester, you definitely get it in the second semester, so the system is quite fair. Um, and normally you don't stay in one studio all the time, so you even want to change afterwards. Yeah. So, um, but some people stay three uh, semester in one because it's just their way. And uh, yeah, here's uh, for example the last is uh, uh, craft and industry. Um, it's really about making a lot. So here yeah. are some paper models going on about animals, and uh, <laughs> also architecture is in this class. What do you else have? Um, here you have some wood machine because we're going to be introduced for the wood yeah. workshop. Uh, we're going to go just after that. Also we have a sound class here in this uh, oh, yeah, trimester, all about sounds, how they mechanisms, how they work, how they are developed, how they... Oh, Francisca is questioning a lot. That's good. Yeah. Do a lot of people continue? Yeah, that's... Ah, no. I w it's still the same, it's still the same. Sorry, yeah, sorry. I was... Uh, but good when you ask, ask more questions, because this is why we're here. Also, beside the tour, yeah. we're we gonna go on, going to the workshops. This is where yeah, it really so gets Next is we're gonna see exciting. quickly the library, and after the DJ yeah. lab, and after, yeah, sorry. Slow, um, slow. After the wood and metal workshop. <laughs> Done, you have time. <laughs> so yeah, no questions, just ask. How much people are here? Ten people. Oh. Amazing. Cool. Good. Thanks. Hola. Hello. So yeah, let's go one floor down. Takes a while. I'm sorry, but. We are by food, so we take a while. you see me working, you know what I did, and then you know that I'm good, and you just have to do So, next gonna be the library. All the documentation is here if you want to for your research. Or get, yeah, stay up to date with stay magazines. Stay up to date with magazine, with... Uh, Hello magazine. again. Hello again and again. Uh, so here you can really get any information which you are interesting. Mm -hmm. uh, about Not cities, about artists, design. about any topic you 
you want to inform yourself more and dive in. And also we have a magazine area. So and walking space. You don't everything. have to sign up for every expensive magazine because they are all here. <laughs> And uh, they are True. always up to date, so you already see 2022. Mm -hmm. um, so, uh, yeah, you never miss what's going on in design and in the world itself. It's not only about design here. Okay. So you really get a broad mindset. Yeah, yeah let's go on in the place Did where the like dreams come true. Thank you. Bye Thanks. Bye. Uh, Oh, hello, first student. <laughs> so, we are in the digital workshop now. On the end, there are the computers where you get the print jobs done. Yeah. Uh, then we have the normal paper printer, low quality and high quality, yeah. uh, until A3. And then we have... Uh, some plotters where you can really create big, big designs, prints, whatever. And we also have the uh, cutter for cutting out, for example, um, letters. And then you put the letters without background because it's cut it on a shirt, for example. And then I don't have any label, but you have like a uh, perfect done T-shirt. Um, then it goes on in the area where you cut and yeah I would say the yeah, cutting the after after printing part where you can like fold cut link yeah for example this machine is for cutting through more than hundreds of papers and uh, really thick so you don't have one by one here on the little mach middle machine but, uh, a little photo studio to make picture of your projects really useful really so it's daylight so use. you can yeah, really uh, document your uh, your little uh, models or things and then you also have this pressing heating machine for for example t-shirts when you want to have flock or yeah prints on your shirt uh, of course everything uh, when you arrive in first year is introduced with like a yeah a visit, an explanation about all the machine, how it's work and stuff. And using the so, machines is free. Yeah. So you yeah, only yeah. pay material. Yeah, you have to pay the material, but using the machine is totally free. You can also, you can also have your only paper. Home projects, you don't have yeah. to pay at all. Yeah, mm -hmm. um, Yeah, I think. Uh, you have a photo studio you can book, but I think now some people shooting. are having a shoot and works in it. But you can also rent a lot of, um, oh. I don't know, yeah, we don't know. The past gate tour, maybe have a look at the first gate tour, we have a look. Yeah, but um, there is like a green screen and a white blankets and big flashes, whatever you need for photographing. Mm -hmm. And yeah. here you can uh, rent uh, GoPro, video camera, DSLR cameras. Audio. Uh, <laughs> monitor like speakers and displays whenever you need. Yeah, so you don't have to buy yourself things yeah. You only need like two times a year. Um, um, and now we can go to the first floor where the wood workshop. Yeah, and metal workshop, workshop. And everything and metal, what's left. All the <laughs> yeah. A question. Would you say that the academy offers the possibility to work on the edge between art and design? Of course, I think this is it why gives I, the offer, yeah. I think this is why I, I come here. Um, and as like we, we see um, this, the third, the second year student, he chose the studio to make, and I think to make is also a lot about just art and fine art and express yourself. Yeah, but but still like you can still just focus on design because design is also art but um, there's no I wouldn't say completely yes because it's not it's up to you if you if you hate art you don't have to but art is part of 
part of design. But so. at the same time, like at the graduation show, people just graduate on on art projects and not really design. So it's really up to you. You are really autonomous in your progress and your your life. So this is the clay clay workshop, ceramics workshop. workshop. And uh, the question, how long does one class last? You usually play cricket with professors and students. Cricket? I didn't see someone play cricket, but we play. But maybe, we have maybe own we football missed game. the information. But uh, maybe, maybe there will be a cricket uh, what is, what is the team. Question? Um, but the class goes normally from 9.30 to, from 9 .30 to 10 around to uh five around five o'clock but we have fun with the, the teacher in first year so you don't have to be here at eight any any day it starts at 9 30 normally and some classes start at 10. yeah and also like the school close at uh, 10 p.m sometimes do you want to talk huh? yeah sure So here, a master student from Geo Design. What, what, are, what are you doing? I am working with metal right now. Like I am using plasma cutter and uh, welding uh, to make some organic forms, and that's the thing. Thank you. Do you like the workshop? Yeah, I think it's like there is quite good machines. So yeah. Quite good machine. Okay, thank you so much. So yeah, here's the wood workshop. Yeah. This is where things really happen. <laughs> you have wood, a lot of wood. You have panel wood, you have massive wood at the back. You can just take it and tell them what you took. You have two big sewing machines. Altendorf, it's a good one. You have all, all the things you need for wood. And also three big tables for creating smaller things and uh, it really depends on yourself what you do with this workshop and have every opportunity but some people do classical wood with com connections others only build benches and chairs so uh, all the prototyping, only finding out what's possible. So, yeah, this is a. Uh, there's no opportunity left, so you really can dive into any material here. Uh, but yeah, the wood workshop is especially the. The one where you can really create like uh, some prototypes really fast. Also, you have the wood. You have a wood turning at the back, but also a, wood, uh, a turning foam, so you can create really fast some prototypes and don't use the expensive wood. And uh, yeah, so we go to the. So the print workshop. So here is also a workshop about printing machines and stuff. Um, yeah. You can have a look. Yeah, it's like everything the classical printing have to offer. And uh, yeah. You can also print these shirts here, for example. Uh, so also when you're into fashion design, this is a good place to experience printing on, on fashion. Yeah. Uh, another question, can I use each studio freely without classes? From second year on, there are no classes because the studios are part of it. So you can individually choose every studio you want and then you are half a year in there and then you choose another one or the same one again so um, in the first year you just take part you not choose something you 
throw in there and you go go through it one year long and then you really choose your own classes your own materials your own uh, specific like synthesizers or graphic design in whenever you want to go so next one is a yeah, uh, plastic, plastic workshop yeah. but it's closed so it's closed uh, you have a, a guy in Sweden who explain you everything about and silicon uh, about forms you make yeah, for no, clay no. for repetitive clay work or yeah yeah uh, to be there into these workshops you just have to go and like ask a lot of questions and learn from it okay this side this is the metal workshop with two rooms wait wait so so we have two Two, two different pieces, the machine and here the, how we say? The welding. Welding part. So we can start with the mel welding. Yeah, because it's loud. If it's not too bright, there you really... can connect your metal and create unnormal shapes. And yeah, it offers everything you need. Punching, drilling, fine mechanics. You can do your chivalry if you want, but you can also build uh, big stuff, big chairs, yeah, big uh, tables, shelf systems. So here, for example, we got uh, introduced in our trimester society and change yeah. uh, to metal. We make uh, metal projects. So and after so the first year, you're really introduced in every yeah. material and you know every the basics. You, so, you know the basic and also when you come here, everyone is... Also uh, here you have uh, a lot of... You don't have to buy your metal your own. You can, but here's everything. You just take it. And yeah, there are also massive, massive metal, sheet metal, pipes whatever you need and you see the instructor is always willing to help you have drilling this is instructor for example he always takes time Um, a question, yeah, you also have to, uh, when you're into, yeah, we go outside for asking, asking questions, wait. So from now on, you can really ask questions. We are, we have time left, so we have 50 minutes free for your questions, I just ask them. Uh, when you already have experience in wood, of course you have to take part in the classes because it's not only about wood making, it's also about finding of, forms, concept, designing. And also you don't have like wood class, you have like no. time to go to the wood workshop, so if you're just already comfortable with it, you're just lucky and uh, it's something yeah. for you. Like, yeah. uh, and uh, you can also help people and uh, meet people. You're just people. already advanced and you can yeah. have an easier life than other people, but uh, <laughs> you have projects and you don't have woods class. Just go, it's okay. It's okay, <laughs> thank you. It's all good. Um, so yeah, uh, yeah, that's yeah. everything you should have seen. Uh, yeah. We can go outside. Uh, yeah. Whatever. If you want, because we have 50 minutes left. But ask any question you need. There are six people left. So, six people. VIP gate tour. Yeah. The night's go. <laughs> So yeah.
Oh, I think it's raining. Maybe we should stop here. But uh, this is where we park the bike. Come every morning. <laughs> People, uh, I don't know, have a smoke here. Go so outside. Yeah. Oh yeah, maybe we can show the yeah the super steps. steps and uh, of course you travel by bike cycle here because we are in the Netherlands. <laughs> yeah, and it's raining a bit, but so bleh. let's be quick. It's really manageable. <laughs> So we show you the store where you can get material. Yeah, it's called the Sivo. Like this is the store who is really linked to the school. So uh, you get like paper, color, yeah. Yeah, what you else? can bring uh, whatever you need. It's an art shop. Yeah. It's an art shop. And when it's not raining and it's not completely winter, we are all Always imagine outside. more than 100 people on the, on the step. So yeah. it's really the place to be and we have this whole whole area here for our own in the summer so it's a big cool place really yeah and everybody's visiting from first year to masters everybody's meeting here and chat mm -hmm. with each other so there's really the place to interact and that's the beautiful thing about this uh, university that you have so many people from different countries exactly. and you really you really experience things you never know of and you uh, get to know pe of people that you never met like before and they have knowledge you didn't uh, know so yeah. it's really uh, an enrichment for yourself and your personality yeah. when you like the, you the this school is really made also by the people who are in the school yeah more than definitely yeah. so it's about the people and uh, you learn as m the same amount from the from your school colleagues than from uh, from your teachers it's uh, always good to know more than you learn so we are back if we have any questions um, what kind of 3d software is offered to be teached we work in uh, rhino works in Society and Change, we, we begin right now with a real teacher and everything. Um, yeah. Uh, and after, the other is more about you. And I think maybe in second year, depending on your project with the teacher and the tutor, maybe you have to. Yeah. Uh, like a lot of people know about a lot of different software. Yeah. And but normally, you always work with this one. Mm -hmm. And a uh, diff different question is, is it very difficult to find a place to live ah, near the school? Yes. It is, yeah. like everybody, yeah, I think. So how it works, uh, it works a lot on Facebook, you have like this uh, design academy groups, or just like uh, Eindhoven groups where people just say, oh, I have a room, uh, I'm looking for a roommate and stuff, but yeah. you're uh, always like a lot to ask, so it's really difficult. Like really expensive also, yeah. but uh, everything is possible and when you find a place it's really nice, yeah. a lot of flat share, um, yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we are done. We I are think done. we also have only three people left, so okay. I think we can uh, say goodbye. Yeah, thank you to these uh, three people. <laughs> thanks for visiting. Yeah. I hope you enjoy it. Stay thank motivated. Yeah. And uh, yeah, go, go for it. And hope to see you soon. And uh, yeah, I will stop. Bye bye. Bye. That's all good. <laughs>